guys, we're in the middle of nowhere. Just forest. Look who's here. The forest is not nowhere. Okay, we have a couple of more people with swords and other things. That's real metal. <laughs> Guess that's happening. <laughs> we are on location for our Shield Maiden short film movie video thing that's coming. That's the sword or fencing group over there. They approached us because they've seen my Legacy costume and I always, you know, I love sword fighting. So this is perfect. You're doing the videography together to. with Felix and yeah, let's see what we can do. The guys found a cool location and I guess we're leaving the swords here. <laughs> I guess we're waiting for 20 more people or so. <laughs> or we are fighting with two swords, everybody. Right now we're playing the game Get Lost in the Forest. House in the woods. <laughs> hey, come on! <laughs> Use the sword, come on. It's not working. <laughs> we finally found it, and it's cool. I have to admit, it is cool. while the guys are, whatever they're doing, <laughs> fighting uh, flies and, and surfing, sword surfing, that's a new trend. Uh, we are trying to create a rape scene over there. So the big tall guy and the girl. <laughs> See, the camera will be on the floor. doesn't want to be on camera because he's tired and I have to admit it is hard sleeping in one go at night because it's still really warm our bedroom is insanely warm at night yeah so we are here car wash number two this is my mom's car we actually went on a little trip yesterday a little adventure we did location scouting and started setting up some shoots like camera angle stuff what we can do and after that we tried the first sequence for our sword fight but uh, it got really dark so that was complicated and then we thought hey close by to our place there's a little like um, place where you can do things and that's normally lit up wasn't so we ended up um, doing the first sequence in our parking lot but it was dark too but it was fun and weirdly enough I am able to move today I thought eh, maybe maybe not with my back but it worked I'm so happy I'm, I can't even explain how happy I am because the last weeks were so horrible I could not lie I was crying you didn't know what to do how to help me up or what to do roll me over yeah and then I had two panic attacks in the MRT T, it's called here, MRI in American English, whatever. <laughs> yeah, so they were way too close and I was just too psyched up and everything. That didn't work, so hopefully, fingers crossed, it works out next week. There is an open MRI, it's like a sandwich. It's a bit different to the normal o uh, open MRIs, but it should work because it's open left and right. So I can turn my head and look out and that should hopefully work. Otherwise, I don't know what to do, but it's getting better. It's like one day it's really bad, the next day it's almost gone. I think it's healing, I'm not sure. So yeah, that's my status right now. And that's one of the main reasons why we actually didn't vlog because I could do nothing and there was nothing happening. And I don't want to show my face constantly in pain being like, eh. I, I felt like a 90 year old woman that has lost all ability to actually walk and sit and lie and do anything. I, I still get up like that. <laughs> I think I look really funny when I actually start moving. Yeah, we got some grocery runs to do, uh, post office for eBay stuff, and then home 
do some oh we should do laundry and yeah i burnt myself and oh wow it's not shingles yay and it's actually healing i was at the dermatologist yesterday and she gave me the right type of cream now it's almost gone still there but yay so for a second i thought i have shingles which would also cause like other stuff like yeah never mind so it's not Casey was actually talking about not having to go to film school instead using the money to actually buy equipment and get experience and do what you love and I agree on one hand but my head was like there's only one exception if you actually want to live in America you need a degree and that sucks so yeah sometimes it's actually good to have a degree so you're enabling yourself to have other options I'm not saying that you have to I actually think if you do something like studying and working like studying and then like working two semesters like I had it that's actually pretty cool because you get experience which you don't have if you just study for four years university straight and you have no idea you were just thrown into the business world and you're like okay that's how the world runs that's weird that's not what we learned that looks so cool <laughs> I hope it cleans it I should have shown you it was really really dirty it's September. That's already Christmas. Why? <laughs> it's still like 27 to 30 degrees outside, which is like in the 90s, 80s, 90s, something like that. It's ridiculous. I really don't understand why I'm feeling so well. I think the movement actually helps. It's like when you do exercise for the first time again, it's like, yay! But on the other hand, I probably shouldn't have done it. But hey. We'll see how it continues. I'm making some food for myself. You see, it's all yum, 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 yum. And the kitty wants to come in. And Yura has pokeballs. So healthy, not losing weight. Not so healthy. Still not gaining weight. It's going downstairs. Did you guys see it? There's a flea was in the bed in the house. I don't know where it went, but I hope it finds its way out. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Let me in. Should we help it find outside? Will it find the outside? Oh no, he's awake. <laughs> he totally died on the table just now. It's so warm, isn't it? Seriously, it's mid September and it's not a, a tad colder. This is not normal. The summer doesn't go that long here and I'm not complaining. I don't want winter, but it's ridiculous. We are sweating. It's ridiculously warm and I'm opening my hair now. I just have it up because seriously, I'm just like sweating. It's uh, because we can. Wait for it. Boy. <laughs> I'm so freaking dizzy. I wanted to film in there just to show how it looks uh, yeah. like. I don't think you want to do that in that machine. No, it wasn't on back then. But it's always I magnetic. <laughs> I'm sorry. So we were in the MRI, MRT, it's MRT in German. It's an open MRI machine. So yes. basically, normally you have the donut where you put your head in. Well, in this case, no, this there are basically two donuts in you. No, no, the other one is a tunnel. This one uh, is a sandwich. Yeah, I like that. Analogy. And it was good that he was there. Otherwise, I probably wow. would have completed. Whoa. Okay, that's, German that's parking. parking. That is extremely shitty parking. Uh, well, I can't really. You have to come out. You have to go that direction. Yeah. Anyway, so I, I started hyperventilating again, but they were like, it's. Just, just turn your head, look at your head, and then they, she pushed me in. And you're seriously like that close underneath uh, the top. <sighs> I'm so dizzy right now. But it didn't feel as long as she said it would take. And when she said it takes, this section takes like six minutes because I asked her if she could tell me how long it takes. So I heard her over the um, microphone. And the six minutes felt as long as the three minutes. So yeah. I think your arm will fall off anytime soon because he was holding it up the whole time. I like the colors here. And now we're going to Mandy's because I'm getting a milkshake.
picked the worst possible day ever. We went to Stuttgart. We actually wanted to take the car, but everything is blocked off because today there are demonstrations against the Tip and Sita and so on. And so we decided to take the train. We made it here, but I doubt we will be able to take the bus to our relatives. So I guess we will be walking. And it starts all over there. The cool thing is, I mean, they're against like the global treaty thingy, but they were also like, um, everybody who's like right wing is not um, allowed to be here. So just kind of, there's other solutions, but whatever. So they were totally against anything that's right. So, so many like, um, Weißwürste, the typical Bavarian like breakfast sausage, which is warmed up in hot water and you eat it with sweet mustard. So apparently that's something they always eat on Saturday. So we ate that and then we had Svechkenkuchen. So it was a very traditional German thing we had today. Uh, but we left them and now we're walking through Stuttgart because we still have like two hours before we have to head back. And there's not much going on considering the city is full of people but everybody is near the protest the we call it demonstration so uh, demonstration and I guess the rest of the city is just empty which is good because we are just walking through and just doing some window shopping and maybe getting coffee or something look at that they do have a Brazilian version as a special right now so that's basically what you're able to test. But although you can ask for different ones. But my mom's birthday is coming up, so we need a couple of different coffee types. Yes, that kind of sounds good. And there you can recycle, which is awesome. boxes minus the kitty and what did the other one go anyway but first of all we go out in the rain and show you something awesome it's such amazing weather for weeks for months and they picked the weekend but it's raining it sucks and if you keep uh, slowly leaving this is just like a test they wanted to shoot the actual picture during the blue hour that's basically directly after sunset well, there's no sunset today. <laughs> it really sucks because when the sun set, when you actually saw it, the sunsets were amazing. It was really warm light. <sighs> oh, I haven't told you yet what's happening. So next year, 2017, we have like, I don't know, 1250, oh yeah, the 1250th anniversary of our city. That's the first time it actually showed up in any records. And they're setting up a picture a living picture with about a thousand people in costume we don't call it costume it's more like a <laughs> can't explain it if you call it costume it doesn't grasp it and you actually are not allowed to say it here well we'll see i think a lot of people are leaving but there's still stuff going on yeah uh, as you can see there are people leaving so the picture will be taken from this and there will be a whole scenery set up here let's see if i can find my mom Probably not. <laughs> so they're actually filming everything, their cameras. So that was kind of a bust. They were pretty much done by the time I came. Well, with the setting up and testing and everything. The actual photo will be at 7 o'clock. My mom is going home right now. She's coming back later on. So I might come back. Depending on 
the rain and everything because I think I can act, can't actually see much. We'll see.